Hey guys, it's Andy from Innovative Marine. I'm a brand new hobbyist, so I'm here to help you guys better understand our products in the most simple way as possible. Today we have our Gourmet Defroster. Since its release, we've actually had a lot of really great feedback from it. Um, however, I've been reading some of the forums and the reviews and noticing some people are actually having a hard time getting it to work. So uh, what I'm gonna do today is I'm gonna open the box, walk you guys through it, show you guys how it works, how easy it is to set up and how it's pretty much gonna do the work for you. So let's see what's in the box. So inside what you're gonna find is the, the defroster itself. Upon opening the bag, you're gonna see a warning label. The warning label is basically just telling you about how strong our magnets are. Don't get your fingers caught in it, it will hurt you. So there's a few different things that we can talk about about the defroster. The first thing is the open-close design. Basically, it's pretty self-explanatory. Um, the more open it is, the more food that'll come out. The more closed it is, the less food that'll come out. But the most important part about the Gourmet Defroster are the flow ports. There's two different settings you can use. For this setting, you want the water line to hit about right here. This allows the water to cascade into the cup, hitting the food and tumbling it, and ultimately defrosting. This setting is used for gelatin-bound foods. For this setting, you want the water line to hit about right here. The bottom flow port will spin the food, while the top flow port allows water to hit the food and tumbling it and you kind of get this turning and tumbling effect. The other awesome thing about the Gourmet Defroster is that when you take these two cups off, you can actually use it as a feeding ring for your aquarium. To help you guys better understand how this Gourmet Defroster works, we've put together some examples for you guys to see it in action. Each type of food defrosts differently, so in order to achieve your defrosting goals, Play around with it and find your special way of doing it. Always remember that having some sort of flow pointed at the flow ports will help tremendously. So there you have it guys, the Gourmet Defroster. I hope this video was helpful and as always if you guys have any questions please contact us and thank you for watching.